This is my exterior motion sensing LED light. I think it has 10 LEDs. It's okay, it's pretty bright. I put any loop rechargeable batteries in them. But they only last uh, a couple of months and then they it gets dim and I have to take them out and recharge it. So it's a little bit uh, a pain in the neck because it's up high uh, on the outside of my house. So what I have done is I use some um, tapping wires and put one end to the positive and one end to the negative and I connected uh, a wire, a piece of wire from the tapping wires to a connector something like this and then I used the solar panel that I have on hand and I made an, another attachment here that you can plug in I think it's a 5.5 millimeter plug and I put a diode in here in the uh, solar panel the red one I have a diode facing away uh, from the solar panel so the batteries won't charge the solar panel. This is a 5.5 volt uh, solar panel and the three LED together I mean the three AA batteries together is about 4.5 volt at maximum charge. So this is 5.5 and then there's a voltage drop with the uh, diode so it's low just about 4.5 volt so it will never really overcharge the batteries so this in fact would be more like a trickle charger I angled it slightly because this is how I would put it because it faces the Sun and then I would just plug it in like so and then this will give the batteries a trickle charge Ho and hopefully I won't be uh, ticking these down so often to recharge them. If it doesn't charge well I can always put in a bigger solar panel. This is only about 90 to 100 MA so it puts out very little power but it should be sufficient uh, to give it a boost so that's how it is so I'll get back in and if I switch it on it would light it's motion sensing so it only goes on when someone walks close by it but like a lot of motion sensing lights it gives a lot of false uh, uh, alarm so I cover a big part of it so it won't really go on until you're really under the light otherwise it will go on when when every car or anything when it will trigger it so that's the problem with this kind of light but it does save battery power and hopefully with this extra solar panel I can give it a trickle charge